look at the demands from Azimio, or from cost of living to IEBC constitution to open the servers that is what that what we're supposed to talk about is it in those demands would you say it's there and if they're going to talk about that we go back to those are just one. the symptoms of the problems ailing this country and none of these guys is smart even i see odm they're not they're this what, they, what do you call them Azimio. they are not smart if i was on the side of route i'll floor them 10 nil eh? because if you talk about cost of living i'll just make sure this unga has gone down then you have no more energy in you you won't go to the streets. He said it should come to hand. The problem with this country is a shortage of thinking. You just have people chest stamping even on the side of Ruto. Mm. If I was there, I'll tell you, Fanya even say, Ebu Telemosha Bey Yaunga Sai, Namafuta, to one Ruto Raila to end up. Free advice to Ruto. Yes! Raya Unazima Raila Kwisha is finished. Unga 100, nothing to do. Yeah, the 100, tomorrow. But there are people. Mafuta 140. Eh. Because it's possible, electricity down by 40%. It is it's just a button from the president. It's nothing. Energy sector, ni wizi nafanya mafuta inaenda ju. Ni wizi nafanya stima inaenda ju. You just tell these thieves, hold on a bit. And the electricity goes down. And Rayla has nothing to talk about. And then Unga, you just organize. You think. If you give me six hours to think. Six hours. Mm. You send me to Mombasa with my feet in the ocean. Mm. My friend. I'll give you how Unga will be eatable. Leave alone a hundred. Then Raila will be finished. Hilary Onyango tells me on YouTube, thank you so much for tuning in. We are at 474, uh, 509 actually watching us live on YouTube and Facebook That's too. That's great. We're also live on TikTok, by the way. Uh, thanks to everybody that is watching us on, uh, on TikTok. But Hilary tells me, Fungua Sava, it is that simple. You're saying if you reduce the cost of living, Raila will have nothing to tell, uh, to tell people. Yes. Yes. But Hilary says Fungua ni Sava. There are still Kenyans that believe uh, in this election and still believe the elections were rigged. You see Sava. think it will flame them too? You see Sava is... is, is, is is issue the issues of legitimacy mm. so you must handle it very carefully because to tell the president to open the servers is to say we we don't we don't believe you won this election mm. so what we want to do we want to discuss that mm. no president will accept in all negotiations yes. in similar circumstances that is always tossed out of the window before the negotiations start but the president then demands, the only way I can sit down with you is if you recognize me as the president. Whether he's because on the or steps not. of Arambe House on the 9th of March 2018, from nowhere, Raila was calling Uhuru, Your Excellency, Mr. President, my brother. Even on Sunday, the, even on Sunday ah, the tone had kind of yeah, changed. Yeah, it has changed. And even Uhuru was referring to Raila in a very honorific that were powerful. So <laughs> even here, so that's what I'm saying. Yeah. Raila has his job cut out for him. It will be more difficult for him mm. in this negotiation than for Ruto. Mm. And therefore, it, it's, it's up to him to, 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 to design his, 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 his issues very well. Mm. And uh, not to be seen to be shifting goalposts and being selfish. It's very difficult for him. There are Kenyans who think, you told us this president illeg is illegitimate. Mm. And now you want to have a conversation with, it, with him. Yes. How, what do you tell those Kenyans that think, well, what, what, is, what is happening with Raila? You see, Ruto is not Kenya, and Kenya is not Ruto. Ruto is not Raila, and Raila is not Kenya. Mm. So we are talking about Kenya. Mm. I think this, is, this, is, this must be understood. We would not be talking about Ruto or Raila. We are talking about Kenya. So they are small. Mm. Kenya is big. So once we agree we want to talk about our country, mm. because we can see where we are heading into mm. anarchy. So nothing is too big to be discussed, including anybody's presidency. Because even if we leave you president, and then the country collapses tomorrow, mm. Utakuwa president mm. It's as so simple as that. So I'm telling these hardliners, stop these cheap games of yours and chest thumping and bravado that doesn't Dutch courage. I, I'm asking say. about the Kenyans that were told Ruto must go. Mm. He hasn't opened the service. Yes. He's an illegitimate president. Yes. And now they are seeing Raila having this conversation with Ruto. Yes. And they are thinking, why are you having this conversation the service haven't been opened yet? Who, now, how would you just open the service? Hmm. It's a, it's, this must be a product of negotiations. People have negotiated themselves out of power. It won't be the first time. Out of power? Yes. People sit down and they tell you, you see, surely, you can't be president. You have to leave. And you also agree. 
And yeah. some boys in some uniform are behind there saying, please, Malitani Mambuenyo Araka. Mm. Yeah, we want to go back where we belong. It was, but we have seen it in the world. So, it is possible people can talk. But the most important thing mm. is can Kenyans sit down and talk about their country mm. and save themselves from destruction. Mm. And this destruction is not even far. Mm. If this thing had happened on Monday, this country may not be what it is today. And people are just joking. When I say this country is too good to go down, I mean exactly that. Mm. We almost lost our country in 207. Mm. Again, recently. So we must not get to a position where Raila goes back to the streets. Mm. That will spell doom for the country. Nobody should encourage when, it. When you, there is a statement from UDA signed by its Secretary General, Clefus Malala, uh, says that Raila Odinga in his statement that is yesterday confirmed their worst fears, that Mandaman was in fact not genuine, saying he should not mistake the president's olive branch in this holy month as a sign of cowardice. This is after Raila proposed this grand coalition uh, talk of 2008. Look here. When the generals are talking, the boys can only be come into the talk again. Hmm? Malala is a boy to wait outside when the generals are inside the tent talking. But this is you. When negotiations about can war mm. and the generals have met in a tent, the boys must be playing outside and waiting for instructions. How can a boy now purport to talk and the generals are talking inside? Don't you think this is a statement from Ruto himself? Because no, it comes from UDA. It. If Ruto were to do that, then he would be playing around with fire. Because this is fire. And he must actually warn, warn Malala. These are generals. It has gotten at the level of generals. General Ruto and General Raila. Small boys, private Malala or senior sergeant Malala. He can't come and talk when generals are talking. Hmm? No, it's not done like that. Anyway, where is it ever done like that? I'm saying if it has come. Hata mama wakienda kando na mzee, wazi mambo ni moto kwa mnyumba, kwa boma. Munajua mama wamekosana na mzee. Uwone wameenda kando. Would you go there as a son? Watch a mama na baba wamaliza mambo yao. They will tell us. Mm. They will tell us. But I'm asking when it has been signed by UD. No, I'm telling you that is the level at which this thing was being played on Sunday was the two generals. Mm. had agreed mm. to engage. It is not Malala who issued the, state, the, the statement. It is Ruto who issued. Mm. It is not Mada Karua who issued the statement or anybody else or Sifuna. It is Raila. Mm. Then how, how can a, now a junior person mm. like Malala purport to be entering the discussion? Ah, at what level? It's, it's, let us know. I keep telling people, this is your country. You can choose to make it what you want it to be. Mm. Yeah, This is your problem. If you think you are too lucky. God loves you so much. Continue playing with your country. It has got Continue to playing it with has your country. One day, Mutamuka, you find there's no country. Yes, it is as simple as I'm putting it. And I'm not scaring anybody. I'm not yeah. selling fear the way people say. Mm -hmm. I'm just saying, Uneza kwa muka Nairobi, Uneza kusikia siku mwaja usiku Nairobi, Hii vitu unasikia ni sauti zingine tafauti. All corners of Nairobi. Unasikia tu vitu ingine zikilia. He's what now, ambao wanajipiga kifua eh. watakuwa wanakojoa tu mahali wamekaa I'm it's telling you sorry to use that word because it has happened it keeps happening in the world you must guard this precious gift God has given you which is Kenya it's a precious gift there can be no sacrifice big and, that you can't make for this country mm. including walking out of state house ambia mgine wa ingia ndani if that's what it will take to save this country there can be no sacrifice too big to make. You do that yourself? I will do it. If you're president? Yes. I will do it. I will do it. I will do it. I will do it. Anytime. Any time. What is power? What is being president? Right now you can see in America what is happening. Yeah. C can you believe that was somebody who was the most powerful man on earth for four years? Arraigned. Arrested. In a briefcase, always following him with the nukes, the cord. He can say, Lipua mm. Idunia. <laughs> so, what is required is a sense of balance mm. and a sense of reality. When you operate with a sense of reality, things become simple. So, there's no sacrifice that you can't make mm. for this lovely country. There's this tweet from Kimani Ichungwa saying, The coffee and none. 
mediated uh, mediated national accord was equal to Nusumkate government. This was presided by massive bloodshed. Uh, how much bloodshed do you desire to get another Nusumkate? You know that is. Uh, is that why you say you want no handshake? You want Nusumkate? Mze hata slice. Childish. Hakuna. That is childish. I can only forgive these people because they are young boys, but it's childish. Because here we are, we are talking about a country that is about to go down. Mm. You know, Kimani Shingwen is the one who needs this country. Do I look like I need this country? I have children his age, even older perhaps. So I don't need this country. It's him who needs it. And I've told them, mm. don't, 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 don't chip in things that are serious. My matters are serious. What Raila talked about the national accord, he didn't say let's he didn't say let us have national accord. Mm. So unless these guys have a problem with English or with their capacity to understand, them, what Raila was saying is the mode of talking. Let's borrow from the national accord. How did we organize the talks? Mm. That's what Raila meant. We organized the talks the way we organized the talks that led to the national accord. Mm. In other words, the discussions were held at Serena. Each side having, I think, four people. Mm. That's what Raila is saying. We borrow from that because we have something to borrow from. Mm. It can still be bipartisan. Even that one was bipartisan, of course, with the mediation on top of it. So Raila is saying we can have a bipartisan approach, mm. but borrowing from the the discussions at Serena that led to the National Accord. He's not saying let's have the National Accord. He's not say let's have a National Accord. Like the National Accord. So we Along, not... Okay, let me give them better English. They yeah. should go to the dictionary. Along the lines of the National Accord. That's, that's now easier. Eh? Mm. We do the way we did with the National Accord. Mm. Not that we produce a nation, the National Accord. That gave us the Nusumukati government. Yeah. But even as we chip in that thing, do, do these people know, I'm, I'm almost calling them boys, <laughs> do they know this country was going down? It was. Ishumu has come after then. He was not there before then. Mm. And God has been good to him. He has, a, he has achieved leadership mm. at his age. How many young people will have achieved what Ishumu has achieved at his age? But it's because Raila and Kibaki prepared the ground for them. Instead of the country burning, mm -hmm. they decided to have a country so that the Shunga may come and be a leader in that country. Then when you chip in something like this, it's, I, I don't think it's good. It's bad. Not for me. Mm -hmm. like, 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 like it has happened. I'm washing my hands because mm -hmm. I'm getting annoyed. And I'm about to say, let people do to this country what they want. No more Kenyans to ah, it's to theirs, down. Because I'm now getting annoyed. When we are just getting there, we are about to succeed. What one letter to it, to it, to it, to another Kusema watcher? Bas, Fanyan will not attack. I will be about to say. Fanyan will not attack. Raila says, <laughs> we will go back to the streets. So Look, he says, that's not what I want to hear. Why would you go back to the streets? What Raila should do is seek out Ruto. Mm. Say, no. Maybe some people pr brought us together. We needed to sit ourselves together. Mm. Can you arrange we meet? The two of us. Mm. Or with our team. Mm. So what the island is, is not talk about the streets. Mm. Is to seek out route to say no. We are remote controlling this thing. Yeah. It's not good. Can we have a physical one to one talk? Man to man. Me na kuja na watu wangu wa wili. Wona kuja na watu wa wili. Tunakama maa tunakunya chai. We talk about our country. Don't talk about the streets again. Even the president, when in Rwanda, said we are not ready for a handshake. This well, look, don't right. talk about handshake. You are cheapening a serious matter. This thing is not about handshake. Why, why do you keep talking about When somebody asks you about handshake, just dismiss them. Hmm. They tell them, Kenya, if I'm the president, tell the person asking you, we are handling very serious issues. Because this thing of handshake has achieved some connotation of cheapness. Hmm. So the president should never even engage that. When somebody asks you, just dismiss it. It has become cheaper now. Because it's cheapening a very serious issue. The handshake was seri more serious than it is being mentioned. Yes, now, now the, when we talk of handshake today, it is a cheap thing. It is Raila wants to be in government. 
So it's, you are cheapening a very serious issue. Mm. And I'm telling Kenyans, please allow me to warn Kenyans. You are treading on very dangerous grounds. I was on TV somewhere yesterday, this K K24. And I told Nani, I don't want to see you a refugee in some country, Malawi or something, mm. in exile, or as a refugee. We should be walking this refugee comes and finding out what it means to be away from home. I've given examples on this show yeah. about me interacting with refugees, mm. both in real life and in literature mm. and in history. I know it's a bad thing. But those countries didn't go down because they had something genetically bad about the people. Mm. There's something so terribly wrong. Never. It is loose tongues. What do you do carelessly? Without knowing the people you refer to also have feelings. Okay? Mm. When you know you are in a country where millions of people think the election was stolen, you'd be very comfortable. Once you are in the power, mm. you must be very careful how you navigate that issue. Because you are stepping on the feelings of millions of people. Mm. You, you, you have to watch your tongue. You have to watch the way you say. Mm. And you have to be magnanimous. You have to show you care. Mm. But instead of doing that, what we are hearing from the leadership, do they know millions of people are hurting in this country? Mm. 